Welcome back, everyone. This is the Wargaming Guy. Welcome back to the hot mess called Decisive Campaigns Barbarossa. It is the 29th of August, 1941. And as you can see here, the Germans are doing horribly. <laughs> and if I remember correctly, um, which, yeah. Pretty sure that last turn we did all that we could do, and so, uh, which clearly hasn't been much in this game. So we're going to go ahead and uh, let the AI run through a turn, and then we'll see what's left. Yes, I definitely don't care about those decisions, because I don't have enough political points to do anything about most of them anyway. So let's see what the Ruskies have got in store for me. If it's like it's been so far, especially in the last, say... 15 turns or so, it ain't going to be good. Little iced tea there. And we'll get moving. While this is going on, let me say that uh, I'm not sure how much longer I'm going to um, do this game because it's clear I've lost. I mean, I'm not, even, if I was anywhere near close. I, I wouldn't quit. You guys have watched me play and lose magnificently on several occasions if you've been on this channel long. But, uh, you know, when you're not even close this early into the game, and actually I expect that the Russians will begin to overwhelm me shortly, yeah, then, you know, it's kind of time to just call it quits. Plus, next week, a game is coming out that I have playtested a little bit with, and we'll definitely want to cover that on the channel takes uh, place in a theater of war that's almost never uh, simulated. And it also happens to be a theater of war I'm very familiar with as I uh, do volunteer work there almost every year since 2002. So um, I definitely want to do that. And uh, there may be some other stuff as well. So uh, I honestly don't know if you've got any thoughts on that. You can uh, put them in the notes. And yay, somebody did something right. Um, they're still really intent on breaking up this, uh, the, uh, Kiev salient. Let's see what they're going to do down here. We broke through there last turn a little bit. Didn't push as far as we could have because I didn't want to get cut off. Um, man, I mean, I was so disappointed because I figured, man, when we get, <laughs> when we get Kiev, that's definitely going to cause them to pull back. I mean, I didn't know if I'd get over the Dnieper or not, but I figured at least they'd pull back, but nope. And why should they? They don't need to. They outnumber me. They Their strength is growing. Mine is not, obviously. Um, and so, great. They just pushed somebody back there. Uh, and somebody back there. Look at that. So, Army Group Center, which course was the strongest of the army groups is really getting their butts kicked right now oh lord they're gonna go through that little hole they keep exploiting these tiny little hole oh and they pushed him back <sighs> man look at that yeah this is bad this is really bad uh yeah yeah Yep. Yeah. So what are they going to do? Oh, eh, well, what do you know? He stood firm. Come on, guy. Oh, crap. He he was pushed back. See, look at that. They're just running all over me. It's bad. It's really, really bad. So... Not really sure what to do here, old boy. Well, actually, I am. Quote from von Rundstedt, In the summer of 1944 comes to mind. Make peace, you fools. Uh, speaking of von Rundstedt, when the AI's done, we'll take a look at just how my efforts at running this war have endeared the high command to me. How much they love and appreciate all that I've done for them. And you are going to be touched and amazed, my friends, when you see this. Because, well, it's just truly wonderful. Okay. <laughs> yes. 
I hope the sarcasm is coming through the YouTube video there. Uh, but we'll get to that in a minute. Um, step 249 of 249. All right. Is that it? Are we done beating the snot out of me? That would be great if you were. Ah. <laughs> uh. Yeah. Sometimes, you know, you have to remind yourself that you do this to have fun. This is supposed to be fun. So try and keep that in mind. As uh, I beat my head against that big red wall in front of me. Well, let's see what's going to come. Okay, start our turn. Uh, reports. Oh. Forces are in operating shape. If they have to sweat through a period of shortages until September 12th when the new railroad program, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Um, okay. Let's see. Terrible. Yes. Yes, we will. Well, I'll talk about that in a minute. Just get rid of this. Unter Officer Florian had a natural relations with a... Okay. We don't really need to see that either. So here we go. Uh, well, here, let's. I promised you. Look at this. Hitler is neutral. Von Brauschowitz, terrible. Gehring is neutral. Von Lieb in the north is strong. I, I, got, I got an ally. Von Bach, Army Group Center, is terrible. Von Rundstedt, Army Group South, terrible. Poor with the guy that runs the trains and the guy that l drives the trucks. Doesn't trust me very much. So there you go. Uh, that's what you get for trying to do the right thing, people. That's right. Okay, let's get down here and see what we've got going. Um, let's just pull up here to make sure they don't get any ideas about flanking me. Um, there is only one division there. Oh, wait. Before I do that, i got to do the reports, right? Oh, crap. Look at all this. And I've got 22 political points. 22! Wow, that sucks. Uh, you can't really... Fine. Okay. So i got to make a decision because they need trucks. Everybody needs trucks. Look at these pat political points. That's a third of my political points. Fine. The guy that runs the trucks is not going to help me. Oh, wait. Oh, well, too bad. I read that backwards. Um, you know what? We're just going to skip all that. I'm down to 15, so forget it. Um, I'm trying to get my map to move and it's not moving there we go are we apparently we're okay fine <laughs> we'll just use this what can we do here if we select everybody 95 versus 44 we should be able to get something out of that let's do it okay looks pretty good there Let's look at the graphic. Yep. They, here we go. Yeah, there's just nothing we can do here. So that brings us down here where things are really messed up. I mean, really messed up. Let's put you over there. Oh, man, that sucks. You know what? No, we want that there. And we'll get him over there. That's about all we can do. And down here, we did break through a little bit. And, of course, we're not really going anywhere, but look at that. Are you kidding me? Okay, well, hey, let's uh, do it. And let's just put Totenkopf on it. Is that enough? Okay, wait, what's happening here? Something weird is going on here. Is it just me or is it... 
He can't attack? Why can't he attack? Man, it's like nothing's moving here on my... Here we go. He can attack. Yeah, no, wait. Come on, Totenkopf should be able to attack. I don't get this. All right, you can attack. No, wait. What the? There. 90 versus 9, that should do it. Yes, indeed. All right. Awesome. Let's put some infantry here since this guy's apparently worthless. He can move, but he can't attack. Now he can attack. But this guy can't attack. Things are a little strange here, but... Let's just see what we can get to attack this guy. 165 versus 130. Ooh. Nah, nope. It's not enough. What do we got here? Can we... Ugh, holy... But they're really beat up, so let's see if maybe 229. All right, that's close, but I'll take it. It's probably as good of odds as I'm going to get anywhere else. Hey, we destroyed a couple of them. Awesome. And there's your text. 7,600 dead. We had quite a few dead ourselves, but I don't care. So we got to move. Now, see, the temptation, of course, would be to drive and outflank and all that, but we all know that's probably not going to happen because we just don't have the forces or the supplies in particular. Uh, let's take you out of the attack. That still is okay. Let's try it. All right. Let's look at the graphic. And, oh, Dang it, I should have put the Panzer in there, I guess. Well, we'll do for now. Um, Jeez. We are in such bad shape. Wait a minute, it's only two units left there, so... We better not. Let's see if we can do anything with what we've got here. 281 versus 171. Throw the dice and take a shot. Awesome. We got him to retreat. 3,200 dead. Okay. Of course, that's a drop in the bucket to them, but... Okay. Hey, we repaired a breach in the, in the line. That's... You know, for us, that's pretty dang good. Um, come on, back up. Oh, these guys can't move. Ugh. Urgh. You, where's the guy? Um, wow, that sucks. No, oh, he's going to run out. If I do it, he's out. They're probably going to leave him stuck in the middle of here with nothing to do, so forget that. So let's just... I can't... I can't move him there. <laughs> Crap. Oh, and these guys, of course, can't move. Why would we want to, you know, be able to move our guys and do stuff with them? What kind of crazy idea is that? Okay... Let's take him out of it. What do we got? 200 versus 54. That's still really good. At least I thought it would be good. It was good enough. Okay, so... That's not going to help. Yeah, we're going to have to leave him there. So, uh, wow, dude. Um, this is not good. Not good. Let's slip down here to the other end and see if we can finally get these guys here. Well, look at that. Uh, 
And he still can't get there. Amazing. But fine, we'll just do without you. And we'll pull him here. And he will go there. He'll come down here. Gonna stack some troops up here and hopefully. Be able to. Uh, this guy can't get over the stupid river. Um, what do we got? Let's see. Can I mount any kind of decent assault on this? Nope. <laughs> can't do it. <coughs> Excuse me. Have to wait till next turn, I guess. All right. So let's travel north. And let's see what we've got here. That looks like a likely suspect. Oh. Well, now. That should do it. go there you go 1800 dead all right so now let's just move you guys forward maybe i'll leave him oh very good slovakians mountain troops no they won't move okay that's good enough uh hello let's see what we can do to you so we'll take one German division out, and that's perfect. Come on, come on, come on. Wipe them out, man. Ah, oh, one held? Durr. One rotten little commie held. All right. Um, let's see. Can we do anything here? Yes. Ah, we broke one. That's always good to see. We need to do that like every single attack 50 times and we still wouldn't have enough, but what the heck. All right, good. We got a little forward movement. I don't think we've got enough here, but let's see. Well, we certainly don't. Yeah. Uh, what about, I think I tried him already, didn't I? Really? Nobody can attack him. Wow. Okay. Uh, what's this guy up to? Let's see what we can do here. Holy moly. Yeah, nothing. One, look at that, 117 to 200. I've got two divisions against all that, but of course they're beat all to heck. Doesn't matter, it's not going to help me. I'm pretty sure this is hopeless, but doesn't hurt to look. Yeah, no way. Okay. Um, I guess that's it. Wow, what's the 4th Army HQ doing so far back? It's crazy. And the 9th Army. Let's pull you over here, get you a little closer. Ah! Come on, get your butt up there. Oh, we've got guys scattered all over the place. Okay, so now... Let's figure out what we got happening here. Can't take this back with any of these guys because of the stupid front boundary. Um, all right, what happens if we hit there? Um, go. Ooh. Ooh, heavy losses on both sides, but we retreated him. Awesome. Police division. Yeah, let's put the. Uh, apparently, we're not going to put the Panzers up there. Well, it is. Can these guys move? They can. Good. 
it is swamp, so that makes sense that they wouldn't be able to do much there. What happens? It's probably stupid, but getting a little desperate here, friends. Wow, that's like one to one. But let's. I know. Um, um, hey, wait a minute. We got him to retreat. The question is, what did it cost us? Um, not too bad. So. Yes. Awesome. Okay, we actually made a little progress. Right here, we're not doing so bad. Everywhere else, though, sucks. But it's nice to have a little teeny tiny bit of good news, which probably in the long run, long run doesn't matter because, <laughs> uh, you know, because that one little spot's not going to help the whole front. But... There we go. Um, let's look at some cards here. I don't even know if I have... Yeah, I probably don't even have enough. Let's look and see. I'm still hated by most people. Oh, good. All right. Let's see what happens here. And then... Yes, I know I delegated him. Leave me alone. A little more iced tea there. We'll go through this, and that'll probably wrap up this video. And we'll be able to start the next one with the Germans. Let's see what happens. Assuming, of course, they don't completely break through and annihilate me in this one, which they won't, but I suspect in certain places they're going to keep pushing me back. All right, come on. Let's go, AI. Well, anyway, while we're waiting for that, um, the new uh, campaign that I'll be playing next week, it, it's a, it's a uh, DLC. And uh, I won't tell you which game it's from because I think we're still under lockdown. Not sure. Don't want to make an error on the wrong side of that. Um, but it, I think it's going to be really interesting. Play, play testing it, he said, has been very interesting in a lot of ways. So, um, and I haven't even gotten through the whole thing because, uh, that trip I had to take last week and some other stuff. So including a big computer glitch, well, they just punched right through there, didn't they? Oh man. If I have to pull back to the woods, I mean, come on, it's ridiculous. It's September. 1941 and the Soviets are pushing the Germans back. That's crazy. That's just insane. Ugh. And between my bad generalship and the supplies <laughs> which have just been a real nightmare in this game uh it has not been easy, I'll say that much. Oh boy. Let's see what they're going to do. Oh, crud, look at that. The 17th tank is driven right over there. They are aiming to cut off at least one and maybe two hexes there. Not oh, They pushed me back. And where else are they going to strike? Okay, that's... That's interesting.
Man, look at this. Sorry, I wasn't talking there. I'm just trying to figure out what, what's going on. Man, they are this is a major reshuffling. Uh, and I've got a bad feeling they're like going to mass their units and really take a crack at or right on the immediate flanks of Kiev. And of course, Army Group Center, I'm sure they'll continue to push. Let's see what happens here. Ah, couldn't hold. So now, if they can move one more unit through there, they will have cut off that unit over there. Dang it. Man. It's enough to drive a man to drink, which is why I'm drinking iced tea, folks. That's my drink. Yep. Okay. Looks like they're getting close to, yeah. All right. Well, as turns lately have gone, that one wasn't too bad. But like I said, I'm getting nervous. It looks to me like they're really building up here to take a whack. Not to mention... Down. Look at this. Look at these stacks. Holy cow. It's kind of weird. They, I think they actually pulled back here, which is weird. And they didn't push him forward, or at least not yet. I probably shouldn't say anything. Oh, whew. okay, good. They didn't hear me. Um, so there you go. Let's see um, what, how many political points we have. And uh, yeah, yeah. I'm just going to go through all this bad news. 38. Wow. That's a lot for me. It's not really, but we'll just say that it is to make me feel better. And, you know, by pulling back here, we can, like, stack up here and move some of these guys up, except these guys can't move because they have no supply. What? Are they army? It's the 6th army. So, obviously, we need to move him. In fact, I'm just going to do that now and then we're going to call it quits because it's almost it's 28 minutes so can't really do much so we will come back to this again uh, I did mention that I doubt I'm going to get this played all the way through but on the other hand uh, you know I'm not going to quit yet so uh, hang in there with me let me know what you think uh, this is the Wargaming Guy thanks for watching please give me a thumbs up if you're feeling charitable after that turn I don't really think this was such a great video but hey I'm trying, people. And I hope to see you again next time. So until then, take care, everybody. And I'll see you later.